Take two, something fucked up. Maybe I simply wasn't recording, but this is one of my mixes from a lot of years ago. It must be like the year 20... Um... 2012? 2013? Oh well. I'll let you listen. Yes, I suddenly did the fade out, shut off, intentionally really. For the right feeling. And I do want to get back to mixing again. Thanks for watching, you will see me in the next one. On trees. Hmm. I find this quite pretty. And there's a coloured one there. This is in St Hilda's Church. Uh, yeah. I think the light switch on that I recorded quite a few days ago, I think, just by where the Christmas tree is there. I think that button may very well have switched all of these lights on as well. If that button, if that big red button was even connected, it might be a scam. Press that button and all of the Christmas lights switch on. Is it connected to everything? Actually, I don't think so now that I think of it. But I like the multiple colours there. Yeah, we're all raving now, flashy lights. <laughs> Chava crew coming through, ha ah, balls to that. I'm not following this ambulance by the way. I'm just out on a little walk in the rain. Late afternoon. Seems like it's really late at night, but actually, it's just dark. It's that time of the year. There's St Hilda's Church. You can't see much of it, but balls to it. I'm out and about. I'm walking. I might as well record something. Oh, I just stood in a bloody thick puddle down there. My shoe's going to feel it soon. Well, my foot's going to feel it soon. A very wet sock. Fucking brilliant. Oops. That was my finger. <laughs> hello. My finger came in to say hello. Nice Christmas tree. There's more over there. That's known as the word. It's like a public library and yeah, you can use computers in there, read books and multiple other things, but I've never been in there. I'm just crouched down now. Can you see like a thin layer of water? It's rainwater, giving a nice reflection on the ground. I need to get down lower to the ground from all of my arty shots in the future. Maybe like another photography video. But I like the effects. I mean look at that. From the tree. The reflection in the rainwater on the ground. It really relaxes me. Anyway, time to stand up there and I'm plodding along. Just wasting time. Not wasting time, but doing things until payday, really. There's a lot of things coming this week. Um, not like in the post or something. I've just... I have a lot, oh, I'm sick of saying it, 
I have a lot of appointments. They go, that's most probably the last time I'll ever see it. I have loads of appointments to make it to. No time for paid work this week. These are some of the lights that were switched on by East 17, the pop group from the early 90s. Early 90s is when I think they started out. Anyway, what do you think of me being sober all the time now in my videos? What do you really think? It's like a new lease or something of life. I'm feeling a lot happier. But I do have, I do still have a hell of a lot of things to deal with. Times are still tough, but I'm still around. Fuck it, I'm gonna fight it all the way until I am fully on track again. Sorry about the shakiness, but yes, uh, if you didn't know, this is King Street, the main shopping area of South Shields, here in the northeast of England. That, like, going down that way is towards the coast and the old town hall up there. The so-called new town hall is down that way and up the road to the right, up Fowler Street, but that's like, the Fowler Street is way down there. Things I do for YouTube, just... God. While I'm out and about, instead of the pure, total and utter silence, I might as well, re I might as well record something. Mm. I've just had some Coca-Cola, the pop. So, got a bit of a wet beard. I'm talking fairly quietly because it's just after 2 a.m. Why is my phone shaking? I think the tiredness has finally, has finally or is finally coming on me. Plenty of videos to come. I just wanted to record this quick one because I'm going just to do, just to document things. So I'm just using my phone for now. Um, anyway. Yeah, the town hall clock there. That must be late for two o'clock. Can't be quarter past already. No, because that would just be the first chime. But never mind. So I'm going back to my old flat because I have an appointment at 10.30 in the morning. And I really don't want to miss that. I've missed too, I've missed too many appointments. So that will really help me. Like that appointment will hopefully at least anyway, really help me get all of my stuff out of that place and into here, my new place. Even though it's a small room, it works for me. The less space that I have, the more simple my life will be. Get that? I'm just like, simple my life will be. I have slept quite a bit. From like, for example, half six this afternoon, or yesterday afternoon. And then I woke up and checked the time with my laptop. And just like flip the screen up, the top, the lid, whatever, and looked at the time. It was like 11 minutes past 10. And I was thinking, mm, a few hours until... I just get myself sorted. So I fell asleep again, or went to sleep again rather. And then I thought, right, it's after 12. Should I just go back to my old flat so I'm there and ready for this appointment at 10.30 in the morning? Anyway, I called a taxi and the person, I think I know who that person is, but I can't mention names. Anyway, she said, um... Yeah, it'll be 15 minutes or so, and I said, yeah, that's fine. And she was apologising for being 15 minutes until I'm picked up to go back to my old flat. Well, some people are in a rush, so I get that. I understand why she apologised. But I, I told her, yeah, it's fine. Just let me get back there. <laughs> 
And then finally, within the next few days, I should have my old flat completely empty, ready for a new resident to move in there. But I do have to pay £25 for the removal of up to eight items, not removal, but the collection, so I'll just stick them outside. But £25 isn't that bad when you think that my bed has to go as well. I'm still selling things on Gumtree. Um, at the moment I don't have data on my phone. I'll have to wait until the shop is open tomorrow. Because Gifcaf for mobile phones, like the network operator or whatever it's called, Gifcaf runs on O2 and I've never been a fan of O2. But Gifcaf, it's, it's really suited to me. It's very pretty much plain and simple compared to other networks that I've used and so much for a quick video that's going to probably go over 5 minutes 4 minutes 19 just gone there what was it? yeah my issue with gift gaff is I don't believe that you can actually top up with a debit card like with your bank account is that right? I thought they started doing that. Oh yeah, you can with the app, but you've got to sign in. Uh -huh. I do have screenshots of my passwords and things, but somebody deleted the so-called app, like the application from my phone, insisting that I don't use it. I fucking do. So thanks a lot. You deleted the app from my phone. Now I can't top up and use the internet. Anyway, well over five minutes recording this video now. I will top up the £25 like a month thing, so data is unlimited. I can't do live streams because the signal or whatever is not very good. But I will have unlimited internet, which keeps me entertained with YouTube. I'm just playing in the background while I'm getting on with other things. And any requests that people have had like, or given me is like, yeah, um, like they bring up a subject. Like talking to my new neighbours and great friends that are. They can be talking about something and I'll say, I can sort this out, just watch this. Because I'm, I'm not being big headed, well, big headed or whatever it's called. But I can actually just use YouTube to, for example, settle an argument. It's like, this is, like, any, whatever subject, this is this, that, the other, and somebody else is stating, no, it's not, I'm like, I have my ways of finding the right words to search in the YouTube bar, the YouTube search bar, and I'm like, right, I'll sort this out by, by showing you, by simply showing you a few minute video, and it shuts them up, everything's settled. So I'm sort of an advocate in a way, you know, I don't like the hardcore like pressure of like, yeah, settle an argument, that's none of my business, I don't want to get involved, but YouTube is a great place to search for things and find out information, simple as that. I'm sick of rambling on, somewhat sick of it anyway, um, yeah, I've got my backpack on my shoulder here. Put a bottle of Coke in there, Coke, Coca-Cola, and my laptop, and my M-Pow, M-Pow, or M-Pow, earphones, little Bluetooth ones, wow, they are fucking good, nice and loud, really clear, anyway, yeah, I've got to get downstairs and wait for the taxi, must be about time that they're here now, as I've been recording 7 minutes 41 seconds according to this. Now 45 seconds. I told myself to not do that again. Just stare at the timer on my phone screen there. And count the seconds. Right, thanks for watching. Um, when I get the unlimited data stuff, I'll, I'll be uploading more. Not sure what yet. But at the moment, 
still haven't uploaded the South Shields, like the town um, Christmas light switch on with East 17, the old 90s pop group. I'll see what I can do about that. You might see it before this one, I don't know. Thanks for watching, bye for now. Stuff the recording quality. Got it. <laughs> Barely moving my phone, it's like all over the place. Um, so much for not being a vlogger anymore. Lack of sleep. I just need some rest right now. And yes, I noticed that I have a cut on my face. Don't know that. Don't know how that happened. I wasn't there this morning. I need to, like, I'm here where I used to live, by the way. I need to roll the carpets up, um, get the fridge freeze out, ready for the so-called council or somebody to take. And all of my, well, not all of it, but most of my stuff is just by the doorway here to get into my new place. It's going to be a hell of a week. All of these appointments uh, that I really need to make it to. I'm worried about, uh, as I call them, full-blown migraine attack. I do have my medication with this for when an attack starts. The sumac chip and stuff, but... I'm just so stressed. I thought I might as well record this video anyway. Can't, I really cannot fucking wait until I've got everything sorted. Sleep is the best thing for me. But I can't sleep yet. I do have my PlayStation 3 and Xbox and I want a new TV for where I'm basically where I'm moving to. Anyway, I topped up. Um because this is a gift gap sim um, you can't buy or like purchase a £25 top up which is unlimited unlimited phone calls, text messages and unlimited data that's £25 so um, anyway I bought 15 and a £10 these two vouchers so when I use the 15 pound one it automatically because I left the data on on my phone like the data option thing I know what you're looking at that thing and yes I've got filthy nails I've been trying to sort a lot of things out anyway when I topped up the £15 voucher, uh, like with this phone, right, I accidentally left the data on with this phone, so it took like the six pence off, and I got notifications from Facebook, which I rarely use, if you don't know already. So I couldn't use the t the full £25, so I've just used the £20 option with GIFGRAPH and that gives me 40 gigabytes of data, which is pretty much more than enough, unless I'm using YouTube all day, every day. But 40 gigs, if it's just running in the background, like YouTube videos, I've just set it to 144. So it's lower quality, it's just something to, like some audio in the background while I'm busy doing other things. I don't always use like the highest quality video, or videos, just plain. Anyway, 40 gigs, unlimited calls to, well, it's just Europe, or at least just England, or Britain, or the UK. Um... Yeah, that's sorted. I've just got a hell of a lot more work to do. Roll the carpets up, get the fridge freeze out by the door. But I can't do that until a lot of my things are where I'm moving to. 
the place that you've seen. I've done quite a few videos there, but ah, oh, whatever. I'll leave it there. I'm just gonna ramble on, and I don't have time to be doing videos.